think we are in a, an important moment for human health. In the laboratory across the world, we are making advances that may change the way certain diseases are treated. There is around 10,000 diseases that are caused by just a mutation in one single gene. And thanks to many, many scientists around the world, we are finding ways of how we can try to correct the mutation and therefore try to cure the disease that this mutation causes. And this is what we have done today. This mutation it affects our hearts. When the size is not the proper size, our hearts will not work properly, and in mo most cases, it will cause even the death of the person. In this case, it's a mutation that affects one in every 500 people, so it's quite frequent. This particular gene therapy, we call it the germline gene therapy, which we introduced the gene editing tools in the early developing embryos, uh, basically in the developing human embryo before implants. And any modification in the early embryos can be transmitted to the next generation. We use the CRISPR-Cas9 technology can act as a GPS to locate where the mutations uh, inside the genome and to target, to use the, the cells' own DNA repair mechanism to repair these mutations. We find that the wild type copy, or what we call the non-mutated copy in the embryo, can repair this mutation at a very high frequency, very high efficiency. Uh, so meaning that we can rescue a substantial portion of mutated copy or mutated embryos using our technologies. These experiments are very preliminary. This is just basic research. This is something we do in the laboratory with the hope that the procedure is safe and effective. We want to make sure that there is no any unintended side effect while we do this procedure early on in the embryo. It was critical to us to apply the highest ethical standard to our research, and therefore we have followed the guidelines that the National Academy of Sciences recommended. The technology that we have developed is quite safe. One day, these technologies could help to save the lives of many, many people.